Hello and welcome back to our lessons. In this video, you're going to learn how to connect your chatbot flow to your Facebook ads using the m.me link. The m.me link feature can be found here. So what is an m.me link? Basically, an m.me link is a URL and if your subscriber clicks on that URL, they will be redirected to Messenger and your flow will be triggered. So if we use the m.me link from this generic number 132, then if the subscriber clicks on this link, they will be sent with this exact message, the generic number 32. By the way, we can rename this. Let's just name this as m.me link. Now, that is my flows label. So let's try it out. If we click this, it will automatically be copied on your clipboard. And you can create a new tab on your browser and just paste the m.me link that you copied and hit enter. Notice that after entering, we are redirected automatically to Messenger and after after that, and as you can see, we received the message that is the source of our m.me link. Now, how are we going to use this for Facebook ads? It's really easy to do. First, let's go to our Facebook ads manager. All right, we are now on our Facebook ads manager. Let's create a new ad. And this time we are going to use traffic. Now, why did we use traffic? Because the traffic objective campaign allows us to configure a URL. There are also other campaign objectives that allows URL configuration, such as brand awareness, reach, engagement, and conversion. But in this video, we are going to use traffic. Now hit continue. And now under the campaign configuration, simply configure your campaign the way you see fit and then click next. Now we are under the ad set configuration. For the ad set configuration, make sure that you use the website under the traffic source. So go down, set your budget, set your target audience, and after that, click next. All right, we are now on the ad configuration. So let's configure the ad quickly here. Now, we are on the ad configuration. First, make sure that you use the same page as the one you used to create your chatbot flow. In this case, I used the Chuck's Burger page. Next, you are going to completely configure your ad creative. All right, for example, I have already configured my ad creative here. So this is my image, my primary text, my headline. And under the destination, make sure that you choose website here. And on the website URL, enter the m.me link of your chatbot flow. So go back to your chatbot flow. Copy the m.me link and then paste it under the web URL. Now, you can test if you have really entered the correct m.me link by clicking the preview URL. If you click this one, it should direct us to Messenger and then send us the flow that is the source of the m.me link. So let's click this one. All right, we have been redirected to Messenger and as you can see, we have received the flow that is the source of our m.me link. So this is correct meaning we have entered the correct m.me link. So once you have completely configured your page, your ad creative, and your web URL, which is your m.me link, we can now click the publish button here. And after that, we are going to check the preview. All right, our ad has been published. To check the preview, let's close first this one and then go to the ads creative section and click your ad creative here and then click the preview button. And after that, click this share drop down and then click the share a link. And after that, copy the link and paste it on your browser. And then after loading, it should show us the ad preview. Simply click the show ad button here. And then after that, you should be able to see the preview of your ad on your placement. In this case, I included the desktop newsfeed placement. That is why I am now seeing it on my desktop newsfeed. So once you see the preview, test by clicking the button here. In this case, learn more. And after that, it should direct us to Messenger. All right, this is a success. We have been redirected to Messenger as intended. And we receive the flow that is the source of the M. ME link. It means that we have successfully linked our Messenger chatbot to our Facebook ads using m.me link. 
Before I end this video, let me clarify that aside from traffic objective, you may also use other objectives such as brand awareness, reach, engagement, and conversion as long as that campaign objective allows us to configure a URL. And under the URL configuration, just enter the m.me link and the connection should work. And that marks the end of our Facebook ad series. I hope you learn a lot how you can connect your Facebook ads to your MMIO chatbot. To to recap, we have learned five different connection types. We have learned how to use the quick reply and button. We have learned how to use the FAQ or frequently asked questions. We have also learned how to use the JSON code. And finally, we have learned how to use the m.me link to connect our Facebook ads to our MMIO chatbot flow. I hope that you found this series educational and helpful. And if you do, please stay tuned for our next videos.